this, but this is fantastic for them. Puck grab by Lekkanen. Colorado's got him along the wall. And that shot gets caught in traffic. Big time stop. Scooped up along the wall by Rantanen. Nice feed. Cutting to the front of the net. Oh, he got all of that. What a save by Georgiev. Let's get the call. You can see the frustration on the bench beside me here. This is just not an opportune time to take that penalty. A chance to capitalize here on the power play. They've worked on the power play a lot at practice over the last couple of days. This is their first one tonight and they'll want to execute what they've worked on, which is to win the draw and start moving the puck. Quick feed to Byram. Sends a pass over. Colorado's got the puck against the boards. Oh, you'll win respect for your teammates doing that. What a block. Through pass ahead. Grabbed along the board by Carlson. Puck picked up by Whitecloud. Fires it! Misses that one, Razor. I know you're salivating seeing that. Oh, man, you don't get many chances like this. Sometimes you get so excited, you rush it just a little bit. He had more time than he thought. Pass broken up. Denies him again! That happened so quickly, that low slot shot. The goaltender's in position, and he makes the save. Vegas has killed off the penalty. Both sides back to even strength. Both will have to regroup after that. The power play doesn't cash in. Opportunity lost for them. Through the neutral zone and into the offensive end. Redirected in front. Nice save by the goaltender to get a pad on that. Here they come on the attack down the left side. Oh, what a chance, but misses. Man, you don't get many chances like this. You work so hard to get into that great position. You've got to at least get it on the net. to the middle. He scores! What an opportunity and delivers! Well, that's a quick one-timer. Right in front of the net. The pass is there. He's got no time to do anything with it. And he beats the goalie. Nearing the midway mark of the period. The next goal could be a big one as we are tied. The Avs get a hold of the puck off the draw. Oh, we'll get some tired defenders as icing is the call. Centers gliding up to the face-off dots here. Eichel's got it. Now they'll look to see what they can do with it offensively. They'll be back on their heels. They lose the draw after they've iced the puck. They're a little tired. Here's a chance! And he gets just enough of it to keep it out from the back of the net. Thompson's on top of that for the whistle. Pretty quickly on top of it to kill the play. Colorado's got it, and they're on the attack. And that's blocked from someone in front. Taken by Eichel. Here's a feed in front, and he denies that great opportunity there. Oh, and that's poked away in the offensive zone by Stone. Vegas has it in their own zone. Through the open ice, they're picking up steam. Colorado's gained possession along the boards. Two on one, denied by the goaltender. Oh, and another stop. Track that puck really well. The puck gets passed to the slot, and he has to make the save on a dangerous chance. Past the midway mark of the frame, James and Ray with you tonight. We are all tied up in this one. Play resumes as they win the draw here inside the offensive zone. Vegas moves ahead with the puck. Moving into the attacking zone. Streaking through center, they go on the attack. Stopped by the goaltender. Thompson's going to cover up the puck here for a whistle. He makes a safe play and kills the play before any other damage can be done. Go, 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 go. 
Offense his own face off, and he wins the draw. And now it's grabbed by Gerard. Picked up along the wall by Eller. There's an injection of energy with that hit. They gain the offensive zone from the middle. Moves inside! And now he moves it to Nitruskin. Trying to shake loose. All alone! Oh, what a save! The Golden Knights will play it in their own end. Poked away in the neutral zone by Nitruskin. Shot! Gives them nothing in front. From off the wall and onto a stick. Quick pass to Amadio. Look at this thing. Got some bodies here on the attack. Drives to the paint. Oh, and it stays out as he gets a stick on that. Thompson's on top of the puck, and that'll stop the play. Pretty conservative play here, James, as he covers it up to kill the play. Teams are lined up, and we are ready to take this draw. Vegas wins the draw. The Golden Knights move the puck in the defensive zone. Poked away at center by Lekkanen. The Avs gain control of the puck against the wall. Taken by Rantanen. Good hit on the play. The Avs gain possession of the puck here in the offensive end. And a little body contact on that play. Stones him in front. Thompson's going to smother it to get a whistle. Can get dangerous if nobody's in control of the puck. Here in the late going of the frame, it's all tied up. Carlson's won it in their own end. Vegas has it in the defensive end. The Golden Knights are across the line and into the offensive end. Gives them a joke with that hit. Taken along the wall by McNabb. Into the attacking area from the left side. Here's a pass to the middle. And that Karen's off a twig in front of the net. Here's a shot. There's the whistle. Let's get the call from the officials. A oh, tight game like this, you just want to limit the damage till you can get to the intermission. McKinnon's great at making moves at high speeds with his ankle breaker zone ability, and that helps him get in on net. Stone's yoink zone ability means he's great at takeaways. This helps him gain possession to send the play the other way. Look out for one of these players to be a big factor in tonight's game. James and Ray, back to you. The Avalanche have the puck against the boards. Can't get a hold of that pass. Winding down the final minute of this opening frame. Puck scooped up by Stevenson. That eyes him on the play. Save is good. Better yet that that rebound doesn't stay in front of the net. It's over the safety in the corner. Denies the shooter on that play. Blocked in traffic. Find some space in the corner. Here he is showing in front. Routine save made by Thompson. Smith's ready for the draws. They will continue to try to kill off this penalty. Let's grab a breather and we'll come back with period number two in moments. has won the opening draw and that should help them kill off the remainder of this penalty the avalanche have gained possession off the wall cuts to the front getting a little physical there with that collision and he made the save to keep that one out of the net and he regains control of the puck steps into it too much congestion in front 
poked away in the neutral zone by Marcheseau. Picked up along the boards by Rodriguez. Drills them. The Avalanche have gained possession. And that doesn't reach the net. The Avs played along the boards. Driving right to the front. Puts it into the back of the net for the goal. Yeah, breaks this tie, James. You know when these teams get locked up tight, sometimes it stays that way a long time. You've got to get rid of that puck in a hurry from that spot on the ice. You're in the high slot, you're open, but you know everybody's converging on you. Colorado's finally gone in front. What's the approach now, Ray? Shouldn't change. I mean, the game's not going to spread out anyway. Even though it's a one-goal game instead of tied, it's not going to all of a sudden be a shootout, I wouldn't think. Here he is. Takes the shot. And it doesn't reach the net because it goes off a stick. Moves it quickly over to Rantanen. Makes the move in front. Big save by the goaltender watching that one. He's sharp on that one. No one to go for the puck. Still early on in this frame, James and Ray with you. So glad you could join us. Colorado's got the momentum with a one-goal lead. They'd love to add to that. Blocked in traffic. The Golden Knights look to start the transition game. Gaining momentum along the wing. Scooped up along the wall by Eichel. And he takes the pass. Colorado's ready to go on the attack. Sends the feet in front. Picked off in front. Puck grabbed by Stone. They've got numbers here. Sends it across. mccarr has been whacked on the play. The official's arm is up in the air. Moves it to Landeskog. The score! This seemed like an inevitability here. Once a delayed penalty arm goes up, it seems like the defending team just fell back on their heels. They didn't do anything really to slow down the opposition. Oh man, you just love playing with a guy like this. The passes are hard and flat, they're right on your team. I played with a couple of them. John Anderson back when I was with Hartford, and then Alexi Kovalev with the Rangers. They could drop it on your tape from anywhere. Puck picked up by Taze. Oh, they couldn't connect on the play. The Avalanche had the puck in the open ice. Sends the pass in front. Oh, he comes up with a stop. Scores! Kaboom! What a shot! Nobody was stopping that one-timer. I really like how he worked his way into the high slot, into position. He's yelling for the puck. You've got to work hard to get open, which he does, and then that pass is great on the tee, and he smokes it by the goal. The Avalanche have continued to pour it on here in this second period, Ray. Doesn't seem to be any way to stop them. They've stretched this lead out, and it looks like it is an easy walk home. And misses over the net! Probably better off to take a little off the shot and get it on target. He's nowhere near the net. Along the wing, up the neutral zone. Poked away at center by Eller. Coming to the slot. Big hit. Wow, James, sometimes you think you can get through a lane, but the lane is closed. That's a dead end. Hague's got it into offensive territory. Centering key. And that's stuck. Colorado's moving it along the wing. The Golden Knights gain possession along the wall. The Avs ready to go on the attack. Steps inside the attacking zone down the left wing. Shot tipped in front. Makes it look easy with the stop. Smothered that in close chance. Pokes it away here in the neutral zone. The Golden Knights haven't done much right tonight, and it shows on the scoreboard. We'll see if they can find a better gear for the third period. From one end of the blue line to the other. And that's deflected off someone in front. Colorado's got a hold of the puck now. And he gets a whistle after they've been under siege here. They look like five strangers trying to defend in front of him. No Finally, kidding. he's able to cover it up. Past the midway mark of the frame, Colorado's got a little more jump in their step tonight. They lead it 4-1. And now it's grabbed by Gerard. 
Thompson's gonna pounce on it and he'll take the whistle. He's usually a pretty conservative goaltender anyway, and so the opportunity to kill the play, he's gonna take it. Both teams are set, we'll drop the puck here. The Avs win the draw. And that goes off a player in front. The Avalanche have position now. Tries to the crease. Misses wide of the net. He's working shot right away. I mean, it's not going to be one because he misses the net. But he has a dangerous chance developed there. Nice zone entry from the left. Looking to make something happen along the boards. The Avs have it behind the net. Through the neutral zone, moving the puck along the side. Colorado's looking to break out of their own end. Ellers swooping in on the attack. Play is called for offside. The Avs win it. Colorado's got a hold of the puck. Now a quick pass to Lycanen. Two on one. What an opportunity here. Thompson's going to opt for the whistle and give everybody a chance to breathe. Sometimes you get running around as the shift gets long. This helps. Late goings of this period. The Avs are giving their fans a lot to cheer about tonight as they lead it 4-1. Grabbed along the board by Byron. That goes wide. Not really close with that. He got lots on it, but nowhere near the net. Hangs onto the puck. Picked up along the wall by Stone. What a blocker stop at point blank range by Georgiev. Carries the puck up through center. The Avs played along the wing. Back to the blue line. From the point. Blocked in front. Vegas skins a hold of the puck against the boards. Taken by Rodriguez. Gaining momentum in the offensive end. The Golden Knights take possession in the defensive end. Along the right wing, they enter the attacking area. Puts it on net. Gets a glove on it to keep it out. Byron's feeling that, and someone's going to the ball. And there's another call against the home team here, and these fans are irate. They're going to have to replace the hinges on the penalty box door on the home side. The fans are losing it with another penalty call. Concludes the second period of play. Still one more period of regulation time. We'll see what happens in the third next. period action are you ready i'm ready ray's ready the players are ready let's go vegas wins the draw here and they're penalty killers they go right back to work play blown dead let's get the call the abs will lose a man tripping the call As we get set for the face-off, a chance to see both teams in a little four-on-four -four action here. Four-on-four -four opens up a whole new ball game. Lots of room to carry the puck. Taken along the wall by Taves. Inside the defensive zone, moving the puck. And sends it just out of reach. Shot right in front. Stopped by the goaltender. 
That's blocked. The Golden Knights have it now. Right up the gut into the offensive end. And that pass can't connect. The Golden Knights now have a short power play after the penalty expired. And the beat goes on, or at least the parade to the penalty box. There's some nights it's, it's really incredible. It's like you can't stop it. Every time there's a collision or a, a conflicted play, you're the team that takes the penalty. Well, things open up for both sides a little bit here with some four-on-four -four action. The best skaters are the ones that are best on four-on-four -on -four with that little bit extra room. If you can work yourself into a little two-on-one spot, you can create some chances. From the left side, they gain the zone. Colorado's gained the line and into the zone. Way too much congestion blocks that. On the attack along the boards. Takes a shot. Stopped by the goaltender. He's been really good on these high danger chances. And here's another one right from the slot. But he's tracked that puck to keep it in front of him and make the save. Carlson's recognizing they're still shorthanded here as they get ready for the faceoff. Back underway as he wins the draw inside the offensive zone. Picked up along the boards by Rantanen. Big save. He's on it. Good chance, but he's able to glove that shot. Hope everyone's enjoying the game here tonight. Another big face-off here on this power play. The Golden Knights win it in the defensive zone. Nice play shorthanded as they get control of the puck. The Golden Knights are on the attack. Shot. Monster safe. They took advantage of one little crease and they were able to race up the ice, get themselves a short-handed marker here. Hard work shows up in many different places on the ice. This is hard work. You've got to fight your way into the middle of the ice, around the net. You're going to take some punishment, but with the pucks there, that's where the goal's are. Puck is dropped and we are back underway. Colorado's power play is over. What a disaster as they give up a shorthanded goal. Well, they're not going to think too much about that. You, will, you want to at least generate a little momentum on your power play. Not only did they not score, they gave up a shorty, which is always deflating. Rontanen's tape-to-tape -tape zone ability means he can complete those firm, crisp passes that help keep the play moving. He's so effective at distributing the puck and setting up his teammates. Vegas takes it across the line. And that's knocked away by Johnson. Here's a short pass to Lekanen. The Golden Knights scoop it up along the boards. They try to maintain possession inside the defensive zone. Moves it to the middle. Great defensive play to pick off the pass. Oh, look at this chance. Moves into the slot. Oh, they probably want to redo on that. Colorado's got a hold of it along the wall. Moves it to the middle. And he shuts down a great scoring chance there. Plenty of playing time left in this frame. Vegas is still down by two goals. And momentum on their side as they win the draw here inside the offensive zone. Gaining speed through center, and here they come on the attack. He grabs the puck here at the point. Takes the feed from the wing. We got a penalty coming up here. Sends it over. Whistle blown, stopping the play. They were talking about a need for discipline before the game, but, man, they've taken a bushel of penalties here. This is not going to go over well. Really tough to win when your power plays negative on the night. They gave up that shorthanded goal earlier, James. They got to get it back here. Puck is dropped, and we are back underway. Just bashes them against the 
Lord. Don't worry, James. You're safe up there. Down here, that sounded like a car crash. He scores! Well, they've been hoping that the extra work they've done on the power play would help them capitalize. They do a nice job there. Good position to get towards the net where you can deflect the puck. So as we see on the replay, that's excellent positioning and good eye hand to deflect the puck past the goalie. The Avs seem to be playing right to the final whistle here tonight, Ray. Yeah, everybody's having fun. Everybody's getting points, and they are steamrolling their opponent. Slides the puck into the offensive zone. Quick shot, and he comes up with it. The Golden Knights get a hold of the puck along the boards. Right through, center it into the offensive zone. Too much congestion blocks the shot. Scooped up along the wall by Lekkinen. Enters the offensive zone from the left. Lead pass ahead. Scores! And they go back to back to light the lamp. The momentum in the game changes fast. You get one, now you know you've got a leg up. You want to get another if you can. They get them quickly, and now they've really put them back on their heels. It's a bad decision by the other team as they get caught in an odd man rush. But they don't make any mistake. This is a beauty. The Avalanche have extended this lead. In these moments, do you want run time and just, you know you've got it in the bag, or do you want to continue to pour it on here, Ray? No, I think everybody wants one more cookie. Oh. <laughs> and he uses his reach to disrupt the play. Misses just up and over. Goes right to the crease, and they score again. And this fan base has turned here, Razor. Man, have they ever, and, and honestly, I mean, they don't want to watch this anymore the players don't want to play it anymore either can this thing go to running time soon the avalanche have extended this lead here in the third they didn't really need to because they've dominated this game for about two hours but there's another one in the bucket quick feed to eller the golden knights gain possession in their own end now he takes it over the line puck scooped up by pagliano can't catch up to the pass Here's a chance in front, and that shot goes nowhere as the lane was filled. He almost lost it for a second there, but regains control of the puck. Tries to get it out of harm's way. Cuts to the paint. Oh, the blocker was right there to come up big by Georgiev. Caves takes a slash penalty on the play. Puck grab by McCarr. Let's get the official decision. Well, they're keeping the referees busy. That's their third penalty of this period. Teams use this 1-3-1 a lot. They like the creativity that you can shoot the puck from either side. You can use the bumper spot. And you always have traffic in front of the net. And he lowers the boom there. And it goes off a stick. Almost lost the puck, but hangs on here as play continues. Picking up some steam at center ice. And the puck leaves the zone. And now it's grabbed by Rodriguez. Rest arms in the air. We got a penalty coming up. Well, that power play didn't look very good, did it? So the coach pulls the chain, and the second group will go out and see if they can do something with this opportunity. three's not as dangerous as it should be because the guys are looking for the perfect play. Every time you have a man advantage, you have to have in your mind, you have to outwork the penalty killers. Another face-off looming here on this power play. Play resumes here as he wins the draw inside the offensive zone. More time off the clock as they grab the puck. Takes it to the net! And a penalty coming up here as the officials oh, all over that as they saw him slow him up. Here comes the call. 
I think this is long out of hand here, but unfortunately, they're not going to call it. They still have to finish the game. second there, but regains possession. Pushes it across to Nichushkin. Ahead of steam now towards the front. Luger's up at the box. They're able to wind the clock down a little bit here. They don't score on that power play. I don't know that it's particularly important. They don't want to give up anything because they've got such a large lead. They want to run this in on cruise control. Made the stop on the play. Sometimes you're in close, there's no room to put it anywhere. The goalie smothered it all. Quick pass to Landeskog. Colorado's gonna play the puck from behind the cage. Misses! Most dangerous place on the ice, and he can't capitalize. Put the hard hat on here. What a hit. Stays with it. At center ice now, he grabs the puck. Byron's the victim of a slash, and the official caught that. We got a penalty coming up. Here they come, three on one. Let's get the call here. Right now, if you're sitting on that bench, the only thing you're frustrated about is the whistle's gonna blow when you've got to start and stop again. You want to go home now. impressed with this. I don't know if the goalies really see it through all that traffic, James, but they get themselves into the best position they can. They cover as much net as they can, and they make the save. Oh, how did that stay out? What a stop! And another stop! Play set to resume with the face-off ready to go. And we are all over with this one. The Avs had a lot of areas to like about their game tonight. What stood out for you, Ray? Oh, I'd say the, the amount of time they had the puck on their stick. They seemed to be in control of the way the game was played and at the speed it was going to be played at. Thanks so much for taking time out of your schedule to join us tonight. From all of us here at EA Sports, I'm James Cebulski. 